to your face or far away. Are you ready to begin? Let's go. Close or far away. Good. Close. Close or far away. Far away. Close or far away. Close. Close or far away. Close. Close or far away. Far away. Good. Close or far away. Far away. Good. I'm going to get a little bit closer now next to you. I have a pen light. I want you to let me know when the light shines on your face by saying now. This is a bit difficult to keep your eyes closed. I am analyzing you, okay? So when the light shines in your face, I want you to say no. Are you ready to begin? Keep your eyes closed. Good. Let me know when. Now. 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 And let me know when. Now. Very good. We're going to do the opposite a little bit faster now. Let me know when you no longer can see the light shining on top of your eyelids, okay? Keep your eyes closed. Can you see the light shining on your eyelids right now? Perfect. Keep your eyes closed. Let me know when you see a recession of light. Good. Let me know when. Good. Let me know when. Good. Let me know when. Good. Let me know when.
see the light on top of your right eye. Keep your eyes closed. I'm watching. Again, if you do open your eyes, you do have to repeat the exam, and we'll have to keep it till morning, okay? Good. So, let me know when you see the light. Keep your eyes closed. No taking a peek. Very good. Right there. Amazing. Let me know when the light is gone from your vision. Good. Let me know when the light is in your vision. Good. And let me know when the light is out of your vision. Super good. Okay. So, both of your eyes are working correctly. Let me check your results so far. It looks like you've only partially opened your eyes three times. Okay. Perhaps two if we miscalculate one of the error data points. I'm going to ask you to continue to keep your eyes closed though. Okay. And again, this is a intuition test that we are going to be doing to test your sleep and as a sleep aid. Okay. So the next test, we're going to test the fifth and the seventh cranial nerve, which is your vestibular and orbital nerve. I have a little syringe here and it's going to blow air on your face. I want you to let me know when you feel that put pressure on your face. Again, keep your eyes closed because if your eyes are open for this, you'll know exactly when I apply the air pressure. Okay? So, keep your eyes completely closed for this and let me know when you feel the pressure of the air on top of your eyes. Are you ready? Let's begin. Keep your eyes closed. Let me know by saying when. Here we go. Perfect.
examination. Yes, just sit tight and relax whilst I come back. Today's video is proudly sponsored by Travel Town. Travel Town is a super fun merch game available to play for free on Google Play and the App Store. Explore the world of Travel Town, where you combine and merge items to discover and renovate the world. The story goes, a storm has ravaged the world of Travel Town, and it is our mission to restore the town to its original glory. How you play is simple. Tap and match items, merge identical items, and combine objects to upgrade together and form new items. Then sell the items to the town people to get the most coins and fulfill the wishes of the townsfolk. You can even meet new town people to sell items to as you travel through and rebuild the town to upgrade and build your town to your enjoyment. I find the merging of items to be super relaxing, perfect for stress relief, and I anticipate getting more energy to match more items. Honestly, this is one of the most satisfying merging games I've played, and I love merge games. I find the colorful merging items to be easy on the eyes, and the selling of items to be stress relieving. So, I find myself playing rounds before going to sleep. Highly recommend you play it like me. My favorite part of Travel Down is seeing the green go button, meaning I can sell my items to the townsfolk and get my rewards. So, what are you waiting for? Let's merge items and rebuild Travel Town. Click the link in my description below to download Travel Town for free on the Google Play Store and App Store today. Download Travel Town now within a week of this sponsorship and receive an in-game bonus of 200 energy points. Thank you so much to Travel Town for sponsoring today's video. Perfect. I have finished analyzing my data. We're going to continue now. Keep your eyes closed. I have been watching you this entire time. Okay, so what we're going to do right here is I still have the Snellen's eye chart in front of you. I have one square here that is the color red. I have another square here that is the color green. Almost reminds you a little bit of the holidays, yes, Christmas-like. Which square do you think I am highlighting, darling? The red square or the green square? Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. If you guessed the red square, you would be absolutely correct. You are doing fantastic. Now, we are going to move on to another intuition I Keep your eyes closed. I prefer to test you on these to make sure that you're keeping your eyes closed, okay? So, I have a highlighting pen here, and what's going to happen is I have a little ruler right in front of you, okay? On this ruler, we have a set of numbers that will be visible to your eyes, keeping your eyes closed. One is the number that's closest to you on the and five is the farthest from your peripheral vision. Okay. Now, what I want you to do is let me know, is my pointer closest to one on the ruler or five on the ruler? One is closest, five is farthest away. Keep your eyes closed. I am carefully watching you. Okay. So, let me know. Am I closest to one or am I closest to five? Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. I am closest to one. Good job. Continue your intuition now, okay? Now, let me know. Am I closest to one or five? Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. If you guessed closest to five, you'd be correct, okay? We're going to reset now. Keep your eyes closed. You're doing phenomenally. Okay? Let me know. Am I closest to one or five? Let's do a reset, okay? Let me know in three, two, one. Am I closest to one or am I closest to five? Let me know in three, two, one. And one. Very good. I'm closest to one. Let's repeat one more time. Okay. Now, am I closest to one or am I closest to five? Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. I am closest to one. Amazing. I'm going to do this. 
this now a little bit horizontally. Now you're gonna let me know left and right way. Am I closest to one or am I closest to eight? We will change these letters though and we'll call them A and B, okay? So A is all the way on your left side and B is all the way on your right side. You let me know, am I closest to point A on the left side or B on the right side? Are you ready to begin? Let's go. Okay. I am shuffling up where I'm pointing, okay? Using your intuition and keeping your eyes closed. Am I closest to A or B left or right side? Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good, we are closest to, yes, the left side. Let's reset, reset. Okay, let me know, am I closest to the left or the right side? Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good, I'm closest to, yes, the left side. Reset, reset, keep your eyes closed, darling. Keep your eyes closed, okay? Let me know, left or right. Let's do this in three, two, and one. Very good, left or right side. Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good, if you guessed, yes, the right side, you'd be correct. And let's reset, okay? Let me know in three, two, and one. Am I close to the left side? Or the right side. Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. Left. You did absolutely fantastic on that. We are going to do an essential oil smell test now. I'm going to give you two options. You have to choose whichever one you think it is. Keep your eyes closed because opening your eyes could reveal the answer. Are you ready to begin? Very good. So, I'm going to ask you, you must keep your eyes closed for this. This part, typically people open their eyes, okay? And you pinky promised. Very good. So, I have the first essential oil here, okay? And I'm going to put that right under your nose. Keep your eyes closed, okay? Let me know what you think this essential oil is between. You have the options of lavender and lemongrass. Lavender and lemongrass. Lavender and lemongrass. Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. This one is lavender. Amazing job. Okay. We have a second option here. Keep your eyes closed. I'm looking at your results carefully. You have the options between peppermint and jasmine. So, it's under your nose. Peppermint or jasmine. Peppermint or jasmine. Peppermint or jasmine. Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. This one is jasmine. Amazing job. Okay. Essential oil now. Keep your eyes closed, okay? We have the options of bergamot or eucalyptus, okay? Bergamot or eucalyptus. Bergamot or eucalyptus. Keep those eyes closed. Bergamot or eucalyptus. Keep those eyes closed. Bergamot or eucalyptus. Let me know in three, two, and one. Very good. If you said eucalyptus, you are correct. Very good. On to our fourth now. You have the options of chocolate or vetiver. Chocolate or vetiver. It is under your nose now. What is this chocolate or vetiver? Chocolate or vetiver? Chocolate or vetiver? Let me know in three, two, and one. Good job. This one is a better for it smells like lemongrass in my opinion. You're doing awesome. Okay. We're almost done with this, by the way. Is this one coffee or chamomile? Coffee or chamomile? 